Merry Christmas, everybody. It's good to see you all here. A revolting holiday. Why would we call this a revolting holiday? Well, about 2,000 years ago, this guy right here, Jesus, he comes to the, to the earth that he created, and born in a little stable over there in Bethlehem. And so begins God's plan. The plan is initiated to redeem back the human race. The human race that was injured, bruised, with Adam and Eve and the serpent in the garden. Well, Jesus Christ grows up, of course, and <clears throat> he bursts onto the scene and he looks at the, the people around him and, and, and the world that he's living in and the, to the religious and to the non-religious and he just says, hey, you're all doing it wrong. And he offers everyone, including you and I, a new way to live. For all intents and purposes, he starts a revolution. And, and, and a revolution is, is just this. It's a sudden and momentous shift in the status quo. That's what a revolution is. And so those of us that are taking part in this revolution, we're not revolting in a sense, uh, you know, an adjective that describes that we're disgusting or awful. No, we're revolting as in the verb. We're actively participating in this revolution, this rise in rebellion, this refusal to acknowledge someone or something as having authority over us. And in this case, this someone is the enemy. And this something is the world system that he has set up, filled with all these false promises and foolish standards that everyone seems to live up to. And of course, Paul the Apostle, he, 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 he expresses this perfectly in Romans 12 too, when he says to us, don't copy the behaviors and customs of this world, but let God transform you into a new person by changing the way you think. That's what Jesus did 2,000 years ago. That's what he's been doing for 2,000 years, and that's what he's doing today. And so some of us have decided to be a part of this revolution. And I have to say that I've been revolting for a very long time. Hey, guys. I'm revolting. I'm revolting. <laughs> I'm revolting. I'm revolting. I'm revolting. 9-11, what happened? 9-11, I woke up that morning. Uh -huh. Just had my staring in a bowl of shoes and left that. to my doctors and my doctor said you know, get to go to the, the Mid Express right next door to what you hear. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Little walk-in clinic. I oh. couldn't hear who was speaking to me too. And it was all bright. I was dying as you spoke. So they got me over there and worked on me for about three hours and then they sent me to the emergency room. I still didn't know what it was. It was severe or anything. But it was like from Friday
this year. This year. This year. Yeah. Side 